I spent a lot of time in the world of physics and I had a PhD in physics and did years and years of postdoctoral experience and in the end I just got fed up with the whole situation that we were doing stuff with really no real moral code and I wanted to start working with my hands. I started to get more interested in the history of the lathe which is a very simple device just really two pins and a means to drive a piece of wood. And so I started doing some historical research and started to get more involved in looking at how you could do that without the mechanised tools, without a motor. Um, and I got more and more excited about it the more I got involved with it and realised that it was, there was actually something which was inherently important in the learning process, which I'd actually missed through going through the kind of intellectual route. There's like so much going on here with levers, pulleys, uh, the possibility of, of finding out the difference between you know, linear motion and rotary motion, and it's all in this one little machine. It's the simplest machine, man's first machine probably, 